and welcome to this Tuesday's edition of EOTSN. I'm Natalie Russell. Last Saturday, the Roseville High School wrestling team won the CVC Individual Tournament at Endercombe High School. As well as winning the tournament, the team qualified all 14 wrestlers to the D2 tournament this upcoming Friday and Saturday. We go to Hunter Hatch with more. Varsity wrestling coach Doug Ash is proud to see his team's success after accomplishing something that hasn't occurred in many years. The last time that we had a team this good was in the early 90s. Uh, so I would say it's probably been at least since then, uh, which is what, coming up on 30 years, uh, since we've had a team uh, this, this deep and this high of a quality of a team from top to bottom. We've had some school years where we've had some individuals that were better than uh, the kids we have right now, but in terms of a team, it's probably the best team in, in three decades. Aside from qualifying for the D2 tournament, sophomore Josh Province was awarded the CBC All Academic Award. Province contributes his success to his years of hard work. I mean, I've been wrestling for such a long time. It's just building up year after year, getting better every year, doing some weightlifting, a lot of practice. In other sports news, be sure to come out tonight and support girls basketball and boys soccer for the senior night tonight at 7. Girls basketball will be honoring Gabby Robles, Jordan Hilliard, and Maddie Law. Boys soccer will be celebrating Austin Winter and Kyle Barnes. And that's all on your home for Roseville High School sports, top plays, breakdowns, and more. I have the Tiger Sports Network, EOTSN.